bottle was good. How's it going, folks? Today, we are on a mission to catch some redfish, pompano, even the bite. So, we went and caught us some live LY pilchard greenbacks. Bullet, and we're gonna go see if we can um, catch us a fish. We're gonna wait out a little bit, haven't worked the head mount in a long time. What? Oh, yeah, them fiddlers. Yeah, that's that's a fiddler crab. I have one of the fish things. That's all it's tarpon. That's a tarpon. See there. Oh, taking it out in time. That's a tarpon. No fiddler? Yeah, it's a little tarpon. Where'd he go? To the right. Oh, yeah, it's right there. Oh, are you serious? That was a tarpon. Would have been perfect. God, I tell you what. You know how much line you got on this thing? Well, contest is a lot. You got a lot on here. Now you better hope I don't see him again. Damn, we was just 15 seconds too late. Yeah, I can go check him real fast. I got one speckled trout. Speckled trout, short. It's called a second one, short. Kayak in there. Oh my goodness, there he is. What? That big redfish. Oh my god. Oh, oh, that's you. That's you. Oh. <laughs> Good fish. Redfish, gotta be. Gotta be. Yeah. Oh my God. Redfish. I don't know yet. Yeah. Yeah. He's slot. Yeah, he's definitely slot. Good redfish. Let's go! <laughs> All right, guys. There we go. Redfish on the board. Pinch tail. 24 and a half. There we go, guys. My first ever keeper redfish. Let's go. Here we go, guys. There we go. My first ever keeper redfish. Check the dot. Let's go. He ate a baby blue crab. God, that's crazy. Saltwater fishing has been a long way coming, a long time coming for me. I've been fishing my butt off in the saltwater and I lose all the time. But luckily for me today, I got my first ever keeper redfish. Let's go. What we're gonna do, we're gonna bleed this guy out, put him in the cooler, hopefully go catch another one. Let's go. All right, guys, first ever keeper redfish in the book. Uh, I went ahead and bled that guy out and put him in the cooler. I uh, forgot how many you were to keep. I'm only, I think it's only one. Me and the old man here are gonna keep fishing. See if we can stick us another one. Get up on him. I thought I just disappeared. I can't make that cast. I was scared I'd throw off my crab. I didn't, if I know I wouldn't throw off my crab, I'll try it. Oh, I thought it disappeared. Thought you're gone, yeah. Sometimes the wave is just perfect and my yeah. float looks like it's gone. That's why you're gone, you're gone, you're gone, you're gone, you're gone. <laughs> you got fish on there. <laughs> are you serious? 
Oh goodness, I'm down to my pretty line. I swear this water's dropping. I'm not crazy. I'm probably gonna go grab the surf rod, put the big float on it, and put one of them big ones on out there. See if I can stick a big drum out there. And like I said, I want all the work. Give me a 50 pounder. Mullets just be out here jumping just to be doing it. What if they're lookout mullets? Gone. Oh, I missed. No, I didn't. Did you got something on there? It's different. Yeah. My rod keeps popping off my arm because it's wet. Yeah. <laughs> coming at us don't know what he is oh redfish baby redfish putting it on putting it on you as you say no 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 i ain't got none on there oh you don't no oh <laughs> oh your bag going over oh goodness that would have been bad that would have been bag <laughs> that's cool He's too small though. Oh, no, get away from that. <laughs> come here. I got the rod in my hand, tell him to come here. There we go, guys. Beautiful little baby redfish. Number like seven or eight redfish in the book for me. I can go get me a redfish hat now. What I'm doing now is we got a couple big crabs too. So I'm about to upgrade my gear to something a little heavier and see if I can stick me a big drum. How's it going, folks? Oh, we have made it back home for our official first ever catch, clean, and cook in the new house in Florida. So, if you've seen earlier, guys, we caught a stud of a redfish that was actually slot, so we was able to keep. All we're going to do now is clean this guy up. All right, first things first, the scales on this thing ginormous and I really don't know how I'm gonna get through those but we're gonna try to figure that out first things first we're gonna take our knife and we're just gonna outline this fish all the way down here all the way down to the tail all right so after we outline our fish all we're gonna do is raise our fillet up and we're gonna cut down until we get to that vertebrae and then what we're gonna do is take the tip of our knife and get on the back side of that vertebrae right there that way we don't miss any meat on the bottom side there we go just like that there's our first ever redfish fillet also look at these scales these things are ginormous very hard to cut through but we're going to do the same thing to the other side but we are now done cleaning our first ever keeper redfish i'm going to save one to cook on the half shell because i keep hearing that so i'm going to keep one to cook on the half shell on the grill and the other one i'm going to do like everything else i'm just going to fry it now guys one thing that you always got to remember when you clean this fish any fish make sure you leave just a little bit of room between the skin and your meat if not all that right there will be here raise your knife up just slightly keep your hand right behind your knife so you can guide it correctly you may get a little bit there but majority of time you're slept with this one bloodline down the middle what we're going to do is get all this red meat out and then get it ready for frying all right so far this reminds me exactly of hybrid and i hope it doesn't taste like hybrid so what we're gonna do is get us some eggs, fish batter, season our batter a little bit, and fry it up and see how it is. All right, as you guys know, this stuff is my favorite. We're gonna take this, we're gonna Ziploc bag, take an egg, this Ziploc bag. Take our red fish, put in an egg wash, put in our flour. That'll be our first official test of red fish. Let's see what it tastes like. Solid, honestly, reminds me a lot of hybrid or it's like a mix between a hybrid and a drum. It's like right in the middle. Very hard to explain it. It's not too bad. It's, uh, it's kind of lean. I can say it's kind of dry-ish. The most flaky thing in the world has a little bite back to it, but it's pretty solid. One out of 10, I give it a solid set. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. This wasn't the best video. I'm pretty tired. That's all I got for you guys tonight. Hope you guys enjoy. Till next time, stay safe, stay healthy. Caleb Metcalf out. Peace. Oh, oh, that's you. That's you. Oh. <laughs>